What artist's favorite product packed a bright, intense punch, influencing pop art and pop culture forever? First launched in 1934, Dr. P.H. Martin's radiant watercolors were made from special dyes and new synthetic colors. Around the same time, a popular print medium was reaching new heights. Cheap and portable, comic books brought hope to a country at war. How did they do it? In vivid color, thanks to Dr. P.H. Martin's. Incredibly vibrant, they could be blended into custom formulas that became the official standards for characters and logos. Plus, they were compatible with the process used to turn hand-colored pages into print. In the golden age of comics, printers used a low-cost, four-color process limited to cyan, magenta, yellow, and black. Bende toning didn't require intricate techniques like cross-hatching or stippling. Instead, four overlaying dots were used to create a wide range of printable colors. Later, pop artists like Roy Lichtenstein transformed the bright colors and Bende patterns of those early comics into a signature visual style, forever influencing art and design. Andy Warhol even used Dr. P.H. Martin's in his lithographs, embracing their impermanence as part of the pop aesthetic. Today, Dr. P.H. Martin's continues to evolve, offering light, fast, pigmented options that let fine artists embrace a classic with the confidence that their work will be permanent.